Anyway, we're yeah, gonna get some rain, we're but we're got my name and let me see if we go live. Alfred Montaner, where are we? Hold on guys. Hey, if we are live, I need you guys to comment below and let me know if we are live. So I am I'm I'm hoping I'm streaming guys. Hold on a second. Alright, so listen, this is in front of the Solis booth. I always like to creep up on them guys. Hold on. Let me see. Oh, we're live. We're live. We're live. We're live. We're live. Okay, we're live. All right, all right, guys. All right. So here's the thing. Okay. So welcome to the 2021 Fort Lauderdale Boat Show. All right, guys. So here's what we're going to do. My name is Alfred Montaner, and we are going to go. What's up, Texas? We are going to go, guys. We're going to ambush. We're going to ambush uh, Solis. Look, come here. Look to the left. All right, guys. Hold on, is my audio good? Hey, comment below, audio good, Fort Lauderdale good? All right, good. All right, guys, wait for it. Wait for it. Look who's back there, look who's back there. Look at, look at Daniel from Tuppens Marine. All right, so this is, this 41, if it looks familiar, um, we were just on this, not on this one, but Daniel was on one coming out of Hallover. And, uh, You know, I am at my favorite booth in uh, all of Flips today. Oh yeah? I'm, I'm, I'm ready. You know we're live on YouTube right now. Oh, oh hi YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> you open up your app, put out for months and look, look at Daniel. Look at Daniel trying to be all serious. Daniel! <laughs> Wait for it! Wait so let's, for it. Oh, we got some subscribers oh, here? Hey. Wait, oh, wait, man. we're live on YouTube right now. Hi guys. I, I bet you, you were a black point. You, I, know, you know what? We're not, we're not driving today. So no, you probably got that over here from the people at Solis. <laughs> Nobody gets you more messed up oh, than Todd. Solis in the house. So happy to have you guys here with us today at the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show. We've got some really cool stuff in store for you today. New stuff. We got new stuff. New stuff. Look, I, I saw Daniel. Did you see the video that I saw Daniel coming out of Hallover? Ripping it. Up in the tower too, no less, huh? Yes. I thought he was going to get drilled. I didn't know it was a Solis. And then, he had to run a boat. No, oh, it's, listen. It's a good run of boat. Hey, listen. He drilled it. And it's similar to this 41 right here, but blue with a, sec with, with a second yeah. station, guys. Really, really nice. So I well, think we on. have something new We've here, right? We've got a special guest to introduce you today that's going to take you through the boat. I'd like to introduce you to Alfred, Stephen Doherty. Hey, welcome to Fort Lauderdale. Stephen, yeah. I want to talk to you because... I can see somebody that loves to build. That's what I do. I make things. Yeah, you I enjoy making things. You like to build things, and uh, you haven't just built this incredible company. You've built multiple companies, and from my research, your dad was a designer. Where? So he was a chief engineer and designer at Boston Whaler for 30 years, and um, you know, after that company got bought and sold multiple times, we decided we're going to go on our own and do our own thing. So uh, after a few tries, we came out with Solus. And uh, this is by far the best project that we've ever worked on. Unfortunately, my dad is no longer with us, but uh, he would be really proud to see what we've got going on I'll here. tell you what they told me one time when my dad wasn't with me. You see him in the mirror every day. Yep, no, I agree, I agree. So I wanna talk to you about that design uh, mind that you have and tell yeah. me what you're thinking about because right now we're going on a brand new Okay, so Solis. last year at this show, Volvo came to me and asked me to stuff in a couple of big D6 IOs into a center console boat. And I said no three times. And uh, they finally convinced me to do it. Um, so after you know a few months of design concepts going back and forth and contracts and this and that, um, we had six months ago, this was, so we had six months to get to the show, and they said, we want the boat in Lauderdale and debut it. And, wow. You know, like I said it probably couldn't happen, but we'll take a shot at it. So we have been working tirelessly. We had all the engineering team with Volvo working with us. Uh, my engineering team, um, you know, unfortunately we had to leave our new 32 at home. It wasn't able to make it because of this, but this is, this is great. This is a, 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 this was a big challenge for us, all new. Um, we took our center console, typically powered with outboards, and we nicely fit in a couple of Volvo D6, um, 440 horsepower engines, gobs of torque. I tell you what, you fire this boat up and it's so different than outboards. It fires up, it's got authority. 
it sounds like a ship and it's quiet but you know you've got some power in there. Steven, while we walk this boat, yep. can they open the hatch so we can see that? I know. So we'll go through the boat. And, okay. Uh, maybe Todd can come over here and open the hatch. Okay, good. Go. Let's walk and let's right. show them this boat because obviously this is there's there's now new real estate because we don't have these outboards, yeah, right? So, so, you know, it opened up the back of the boat. We've got a great. We turned the engine box into a great big seat that's fully functional. Uh, it turns into a lounge. It's a seat facing forward. It's a seat facing out. Uh, we're able to get rid of these engines on the back. I love this. The stern of the boat. I love this. We've got a dive ladder onto the platform on this side and another ladder on the other side for a, a real big uh, dive tank. Uh, lots of more real estate. Um, Absolutely. Look at this, guys. We have a system that will come back and cover up all this area, if you like. There's a lot of different configurations we can do. Uh, going forward in the boat, we've got uh, a summer kitchen. So Stephen, when when you're driving, right? Yep. When I'm when I'm on a boat, when I'm outside, I'll smoke a cigar and I just think for hours. That's what I do. And I got ideas yeah, and I gotta ideas. Give up the cigars. Well, okay, well, maybe without yeah, the cigar. Yeah, maybe you talk me into one. <laughs> uh, and that's what I do. You know, my wife thinks that I'm just being bored or whatever, and I'm sitting back and I'm thinking about how can I make this experience better. And I I think of myself as a problem solver. And you know, I go through when I'm on the boat, I'm, I'm out there, you know, how can I, um, you know, improve the cup holders and the things on the boat? So we, we come down, we've got magnets you, molded in. You just, you just, well, you could so have shanked me real quick, yeah. Stephen. Well, Where did that come up? Did you, you see how fast he pulled that out? You guys, we're going to have to end this video. I got to go. Let me tell you, where's the gun? Where's the you're, gun? You know, you know you're pretty intimidating. <laughs> uh, I got to be prepared. Where? We've got magnets built into the upholstery. So Quick. instead of snaps, this is all done with magnets. Beautiful. Wow. All right. Easy. Snap them in, and and we just we just had this open. So and we just opened up the hatch. You can see how nicely these Volvo engines fit in here. All right. So so now now here's what I'm seeing right now. You know what I'm seeing right now? I'm seeing mega tender mothership, Absolutely. same fuel make it happen Absolutely. i so want it actually the fuel burn on this is better than that of an outboard um, we're cruising at 40 knots burning 35 gallons an hour I, this is a game changer yeah. this is a game changer and i'll tell you what there's a market for this and i think it's a, a, a market that a lot of people haven't tapped into there absolutely is. so you know over the years the outboard engines have gotten bigger and more expensive yeah and now these engines can compete with outboards all right so let's show them maybe they haven't seen this on my channel but you have you have your garmin uh, back here Th this guys if you not have not seen other videos of of the solace you're definitely okay, gonna so want to watch those everybody well. likes the the, the the cockpit look with the flat screens and everything and we we made this ultimate all of our switches are flush everything is flush we have a dark uh frosted top here so we're knocking down the glare we were able to open up our windshield and you know, I came up with that design I for love nighttime that. visibility. I love you that. You need to get the window out of the way. And then also when you're trolling, going slow, you've got a breeze. You get into some heavy weather, you close the window, well, and everybody's you know, good. You know, when I did a video with Daniel, we did the same thing, right? Daniel goes, Alfred, watch this. And he opened up the windshield, and I was like, wow, that it felt go. so good. You can't have a boat now without a windshield yeah. that opens. Yeah, that's so, super cool. Also, uh, sitting back, we've got very comfortable helm chairs. They're on a shock system, so you can truly sit down in this boat and drive it. Guys, So while is... you're here, we've got a remote control system in the armrest to control all the Garmin features. So we can run the autopilot and pretty much anything if it's on the screen, so we can run it here. What highway then, were you on when you thought about that one? I want to know uh, that. With this one here? This, 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 this yeah, this, um, this, this idea. What, what highway were you on when you were thinking, I don't know. how I cool another, would this be? I was in another world somewhere. I don't know where I was. <laughs> but uh, then, um, you know, about three quarters of the way through the project, just a couple of months ago, okay. Volvo came and said, we want to put the joystick built into the seat. And I'm like, dude, this is, you know, we're already this far along. Um, it's a challenge to get this thing done. I don't think we can accommodate it, but we did, and we now have the joystick. So this will control everything with the engine. So we can we can do the um, autopilot. 
we can steer, we can dock, we can do everything. And so between the two, we can sit back and run this boat. Do you got do you got um, miles per gallon on this yet? Any any data on this yet? Or? We've got a little bit of data. So we're burning at cruise about 35 gallons an hour, running 40 miles an hour. Nice yeah. guys, diesel in the house. So let's walk forward and uh okay so one more thing i want to point out here okay so not everybody is um is is tall enough sometimes to be able to see over these tall consoles everybody wants a big cabin so you're pressing you a button that's coming up and down and so instead of folding something down or or coming up with some other way we just push a button and it comes up out of the floor and we're able to raise up five inches so whoever's basically yeah. you know you tall you short yeah yep yeah. Nice, nice feature. Maybe, you know, your wife is a little shorter than what you are. Exactly. She wants to navigate exactly. the boat. Yep. That's awesome. Yep. All right, guys, let's go forward. The 41 Solis here live, Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show with Mr. Stephen Doherty. So, you know, everybody's been putting bow tables and really clogging up the bow of the boat with a table and upholstery and all the things. I'm a boater. I want to be able to get to my bow I want to I want to handle my anchor, handle the dock line. Sometimes I'm on the boat by myself. Yeah. And I've got to get up here and, and handle it. So we opened everything up. We still have the seating on the sides. We have room for everything. We have dock lines. We have uh, a very open anchor locker. With your windlass. So we've got the windlass, and we do this on a bridge so that we've got better access down inside for the anchor road. And then we've got space for four fenders. And so, you know, a lot of people buy a boat, they think there's all this room and all this space. Yeah. And until you start putting your stuff on it and you run out of room quick, we yeah. have a space for everything on the boat. We had Frigid Rigid build us coolers specifically for us. They use our latch system. They're removable if you'd like. And then they also put the magnets in. And you also have more magnets here on the gunnels. We have magnets. So you can put your cup holder, guys. I'll tell you what, th th those are those moments that you say, wait a second, um, where am I gonna put my drink? I gotta get some line, I don't wanna exactly. go ahead and have my drink or, spill. Or a knife, or a hook, or anything that's magnetic, it'll stick right down. So how many times you're on board a boat and you're looking for a trash can? So I thought of this while I was at McDonald's. Nice! Right. Smash that like for McDonald's, guys. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Right. Something so simple and youthful. Storage. We've got tackle storage. We've got storage, to put, we can put, uh, six rods on each side mm -hmm. and lockable. If you notice the bow cushions, this comes down and sinks in. So my wife, this is her favorite spot. I like to go fast. So she can sit up here and whether running 50 miles an hour or 70 miles an hour, she's confident that she's gonna stay put in the bow seat. Nice. And I'll tell you, um, you guys have done a great job in this cabin as well. Thank you. So, Come on around, I'll trade spots with you. Okay, great. You guys, he's gonna show us inside the cabin okay so you know the other thing with the cabin and the door cabins are getting bigger and we're losing the space here to be able to swing a large door so that was a challenge i wanted a big door to be able to get rods in and out and gear and all that so we came up with this hinge bigger guys like alfred montanier that's right that's right wait wait you're not supposed to agree with me steven okay. come on man so, uh, <laughs> and nice. then it, it latches in the open position So we got air conditioned. Nice, I lots feel of that. Space. We have beds in here. You can take out these backrest cushions and lay them down. Uh, even inside the cabinets, our koozies that we supply have magnets in them, and they stick and they stay right there. And you use the same ones that you carry them out anywhere. We have a liquor cabinet underneath. Uh, as we get older, we find that we need uh, a little bit of liquor on board the boat. A little bit more, have, maybe. Uh, uh, an ice bucket here, accessible through the top, storage on the steps. We have a full rain shower in the head. Um, also, we put windows let, in the cabin. Let so me get in there so I can show that head. I want to shoot definitely. Can, you can see outside the cabin and you don't, you, you get less seasick. Let's, let's show that, let's see that there. All right, so we've got a full rain shower overhead. A mirror is lit, it's lit around the mirror. Very, very nice. And it's it's very spacious and in here. Notice the headroom, too. Yeah. We've got a lot of headroom. I don't know, my dad's always told me that rich people are tall. I don't know what it is about that. Well, Storage here. You know, um, they're getting a little shorter, though, right? Yeah. <laughs> 
All right. All right, Stephen. So, what else is coming out of this uh, amazing mind that you got? What What can we expect going forward? So, we're always innovating. Um, we've always got something on the table. I've got a full engineering department. In our factory, we have a full Haas machine shop, mm -hmm. a full welding facility, paint shop. We build everything in-house. We build our wire harnesses in-house, and you know we're looking to grow. And my way to grow isn't necessarily going out and just selling more models. Um, we are, we're building more models. So we've got a 29 with twin outboards, a 32 with twins. We should see the 32 in Miami, hopefully. Nice. Um, and then we've got a, uh, a project that we're working on right now in conjunction with uh, Roy Merritt. And it's a 56-foot uh, catamaran. Um, wow, that's a big that's, boy. That's a big project we've got going on. That's nice. And um, we'll be seeing that hopefully in the next uh, year and a half or so. And uh, all kinds of new stuff with that. Um, and we've got a uh, engineering department is currently working on a 38 and a 48. So uh, that's all the new stuff that's coming. Um, if, if you guys wanted to invite somebody to go take a look at your shop, where would they go? So our factory yeah. is in Edgewater, Florida. Okay, so they're, they're in Edgewater, yeah, guys. And, and, you know, we have tours and people are welcome anytime. Um, and, of course, you can go visit, get online, find one of our dealers, and, uh, you know, providing they have a boat in stock. Uh, that seems to be a problem these days. Yes, uh, and, and, well. and price increases too, uh, because a lot of price increases because the, the the materials that we need to build boats are, are just continuously going up. Right. So um, that's obviously they're, obviously they're obviously a challenge. Offshore, yeah. On ships, and um, you know maybe maybe California can start uh, unloading container ships after three o'clock in the afternoon. Well, and ease things up on us a little bit. Well, listen up. Maybe I you know somebody. I, I, I don't want to get into California because you have a knife and uh, I got a boat show I got to film. And I want to thank you, Stephen, because uh, you guys have always been super hospitable between uh, Todd, Daniel, and you know everyone here. Every time I come to the show, you guys have always given me love. All my subscribers know that I'm always here because I'm a big fan of the thing. I'm a big fan of the 345 as well. So uh, I look forward to filming more of uh, your boats and uh, I'm going to... I guess film other boats right now now I don't get to talk to all the owners like when I'm at the show while I'm live that just doesn't happen yeah it's a little hot and muggy around here they probably went home but, uh, <laughs> oh! we, we really appreciate you coming and seeing and visiting thank, with us thank you and so much I tell you what you're, you're uh, my, my son Ryan is your biggest fan he'll be here tomorrow afternoon hopefully well, you well, well Ryan and I are uh, we're gonna give uh, our subscribers a uh, another treat uh, we'll talk that on the Perfect. weekend awesome. and guys I want to thank the people here at Solis live Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show with Mr. Stephen Doherty thank you so, right, so much you, Stephen sir. all right guys don't call me sir Stephen oh he doesn't know about those he called me sir Todd he called me sir we're live Todd you know you don't call out for Stephen you did so good it's, it's, I can't believe this my wife is trying to make, train me to be polite. Oh, oh. And, you know. no, I'm out of here. Don't worry about it. Stephen Doherty over here. Solace, guys. We're live. Thank you so much, Stephen. All right, guys. Take care. All right, guys. Look at this monster, guys. All right. So how cool is that? Get ready, guys, because the chit show begins. One, two, three. Let's go. All right, guys. So how cool is that? I've never been able to interview... Mr. Stephen Doherty, and he is the brain of this entire operation. Super deep thinker, innovator, creator. Dad was a lead designer for Whaler, and uh, you know, he probably heard and, and thought design his whole life. So we're, we're gonna go walk, guys. Let's take a walk if you guys wanna hang out. I'm gonna try to see what I can do to li listen to the chat, okay? I can't respond to many people, guys. There's a lot of people here. But I do want to show you kind of like what's going on here at the show. So let's wait for it. All right, so we're passing right now through Regulator. And uh, wow, this is a brand I like, guys. I did some videos from Annapolis. And uh, I still have yet to put it up. Guys, if I get pushed in the water, it's happening as we speak, okay? So um, it's happening, right? So if you are here at the show and you want to meet me, this is where I'm at right now, crisscross. So, 
let's see what we got going on here. Oh boy. Let me check the stream, make sure we're looking good. All right, we're just passing Jupiter. How cool is this, guys? We're literally live on YouTube. All right, so right now this is Jupiter. Um, let me see the... What do you guys think about these, guys? Tell me, let me know. Comment below, guys. I'm, I'm trying to see. Remember, since I'm using actually my phone as also a streaming device, it also doesn't give me the best way of talking to you guys. But I can see there's 300 of you guys in here. Thank you guys for jumping in. Look at Alex. Go Winky from the Discord, guys. And uh, welcome to the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show. All right, guys. So here's, here's what we're going to do. We're going to cross over. Oh, no. Every time I say, we're going to cross over. Alfred's going to cross over. No, we need the chicho forever. All right, guys. We're going to go to the other side, all right? We're going to go to the other side of the show. Um, I want you guys to see the uh, center consoles in uh, that area. There's a lot of center consoles here as well, okay? But um, I want you guys to see what I call the monsters, right? We're passing here the whaler booth. And uh, obviously, obviously, whaler is huge in the market. A lot of people are fans of the market uh, when it comes to the whalers. We got Pursuit here. We've done some videos with them as well. We're going to probably try to do some dedicated videos with them. Oh, I'm going to show you guys some interesting stuff now. So wait for it. All right. The 300. You guys remember the Ox Diesel 200 that we did a video on on Intrepid? We are going to see the 300. All right. A lot of people don't know we're live, guys. But um, a smash a like and uh, tell me in the comment section on the chat if we're clear. If we're clear, I'm doing everything in my power to make sure we get some good. All right, so, all right, guys, so wait for it. You guys have never seen this. This is the first time we're going to see this ever in America. The brand new That's it. 300 Ox Diesel is right here guys 300 ox diesel look at this guys everybody is like wow it's massive in cooperation with bmw what do you guys think we got to see if we can go ahead and do a dedicated walkthrough of that diesel um, badass a lot of badass boats guys coastal craft those of you guys that uh, follow my channel, you know, you guys saw the video with Coastal Craft. Jeff is over there on the other side. So this is right now, guys. We're live right now in the boat show. Somebody said right now the chit show. All right, listen up, guys. The last Myra and kids was the last person I'm going to see comment right now. I'm going to put my phone in my pocket and we're going to walk. Okay, so welcome to the show, guys. So. You know I'm a big fan. All right, so here's the food and all that stuff, guys. For Friday, we just had a little shower that passed through, a little rain shower. But we got Williams. You know I'm a fan of Williams. Beautiful. Oh, we got it. Sorry, we're live on YouTube. I, I'm sorry. I just, I just wanted to say I'm sorry we're live on YouTube. Hey, <laughs> Williams in the house, guys. What about, what about one of these little jet tenders, huh? What do you think? Oh, well, you know, you want to be all electric? Maybe we can go in uh, an electric uh, Volt. What do you think? Are we going to wait for it? Look at this, guys. Wow. That is so wild. All right, guys. Wait. We need some uh, inflatables in our life? Yeah, I'm digging them. How cool is this? All right, guys, so listen up, just so you have an idea, if you come to the show. Wow, look at this. Wow, I'm live on YouTube, so don't, don't say, that's the king of Hallover. You know what? This is, this is the monster that can go to Hallover Beach. 
Absolutely. And right up on the beach. Wow. Look at this, guys. Badass. All right. I'm going to come back. We're going to do a dedicated walkthrough on this. I'm live on YouTube. We're going to do this. The King of Hallover is going to come here. We're going to look. We're going to drive it out of here live and then and just, just dump it. Let's do it. I'm ready. I'm serious. All right, guys. Wait for it. Chicho in the house. <laughs> All right, guys. It's going to get wild. It's going to get wild, guys. It's going to get wild. All right. So look, let's continue. Let's walk. We're right now walking towards Nortec, MTI, Cigarette, Midnight, Concept, Sea Hunter, Mystic. Wait for it. Look at Highfield, guys. You know I'm a big fan of these little Highfield. What's, high What's up, guys? We're live on YouTube right now. <laughs> oh, that's so wild. All right. All right, so we're walking to the other side of the show, guys. So normally the bigger boats, well, not, not necessarily normally, right? <laughs> Look, the smaller boats are on this side. No, that is so cool. I want one. Daddy's money. Look at that. What do you think about that, huh? All right, guys. Uh, I think my grandson will fit in that. We got AV coming over here. Now you have some tents here. Um, last year it was more open, right? But this year it looks like a lot more people feel more comfortable coming out and about. So that's what we're seeing. We're seeing a little bit of water on the floor, guys. It did just rain now. So we're going to stream until the wheels fall off over here, guys. And if you just joined the stream, oh boy, you guys know I don't like getting my feet wet. Miss Montaner is going to be like, you ruined a new set of shoes. And uh, here's something new that hasn't been here at the show ever um, which is a little different we got a lot of cars at this show look at Novarania this one's badass I definitely want to walk this right here look at this thing look at this look at this thing right here wow talk about that that is badass this is badass what do you guys think Comment below. Como, Italy is where they're making. What's going on? Chicho is live right now on YouTube. You know this. You know, we got a Godiak right in front of us, guys. The East Marine Godiak 420 built on an aluminum chassis. Seven aluminum? Aluminum, powder coated. Built on an aluminum chassis, comes standard with a 50 horsepower. We work directly with Suzuki and Tahatsu outboards. Uh huh. You have the option of Suzuki or Tahatsu. Hey, this is our Achilles Hypalon. Give me some, give me some pricing, quick! I'm, I'm running and gunning. Right here. What do you need to see? What do I want? I want, I want prices right now. Twenty-one nine ninety-five, fully loaded out the door. Twenty-two k. It's mine, out the door. Five year warranty on the tube and five year warranty on the outboard. Hey, I got enough subscribers right now watching. They're gonna buy right now. Luxury rib tenders, luxury rib tenders. Ah, you know. Hey, I'll catch you guys on a dedicated video. All right, guys. It's live on YouTube. We're live. <laughs> they don't even know I'm live, guys. They have no idea. Oh my goodness. Argos, Nodek. Look at the Argos Nautix. All right, guys, we got that roll coming. Watch, I'm gonna get Ignacio and surprise him. Here's the thing. Here's Ignacio. Here's here's the brains behind this operation. We're live on YouTube. We're live on YouTube. <laughs> Welcome to the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show. I see something new, my friends. Wait for it. Hey, I haven't seen this. We're gonna talk later. What are you gonna tell me? What about? The new diesel? Yeah. Amazing. Amazing? Amazingness. That's what we do. Go and take a look at the deep beat. All right, guys. Come here. Oh, boy. Uh, do, you, do you want to slice like butter? What are you trying to cut here? Go right on now. All right, guys. Hey, comment below. What do you guys think is going to happen here? Ladies, 
I, I'm, I have a camera here. I got to put an angle here. I got to take care of my women. I know the subscribers that I got. Got to watch out, ladies. I know there's a couple of... Hey, I'm going to come back. I'm live right now on YouTube. Guys, you'll see yourself right now. Follow the restream. We're live right now. It's happening. The three... Hey, thanks a lot, man. Where at? Right where you know where the high are at? Uh huh. Which one is it? The North Star. I'm gonna pass by later. We're gonna do a dedicated video. I'm live now. Guys, look at this. Look at this here. So this is new. This is new, guys. This is new. Welcome to amazingness, right? Um, are you guys getting the vibe of where I'm taking you? Are you guys actually getting the vibe? Because I want you guys to get the vibe. I'm getting back on my phone, guys. I can't respond to all messages. I will read the stream after the fact. And if there's anybody that's giving me a super chat, I am sorry if I have not addressed you, but I have to try to run and gun here, guys. All right. We got some Jeeps here. Um, remember the X-Shore electric poke we did a, a walkthrough and uh, C-Tron, 100% electric right there. Get ready. Get ready, guys. Hey. This is now, Make this, thing right. this is the dock we want to be on, guys. Wow. Nortec always comes with the fire, guys. Nortec powerboats over here, guys. When you come here and you hang out at Nortec, you also have a bar right here. How cool is this? And uh, I don't know, what do you think? I'm digging uh, the monsters, right? Now, this is, this was one of my favorite boats last boat show, which was the Flyer. And they have a whole different layout, guys. I have none, not done a dedicated walkthrough with this yet, but t take a look at this beauty, guys. This is the Nortec Flyer. So badass. Comment below, what do you guys think? Oh man. And this layout is a little bit different. You guys remember that the whole bow of the Flyer, the first one, was completely closed off. So it looks like this customer wanted it to have an open bow. And then you still have access to that little, you know, head and, and uh, little cabin space in the center of the boat. We're here in front of uh, CV, the, remember the dock, uh, I'm sorry, the Hallover Inlet Destroyer, the 45? That is a monster. But wait, we got a 390Z right here. This is another monster that destroys Hallover. You guys know that Hallover series that I do, the king of Hallover. The 370 with twin 600s. Get ready, guys. It's gonna get wild. And uh, more CVs over here, guys. CV has a big uh, lineup here. Look at the formulas. We have some formulas here. How cool are these? If you guys have not seen the walk, uh, the live walk that I did at the Annapolis show after this video, take a look at the Annapolis show so you guys can see some of the stuff that well, I was filming in Annapolis. Wow, how nice is this, dude? This is so nice, guys. Formula in the house. And we got the world famous Midnight Express. Chicho. Chicho in the house. Hey. We're live on YouTube right now, man. What's up? Say hello to YouTube. Guys, nobody knows I'm coming. So, look who's back there. I'm live on YouTube and somebody just said that they wanted to marry you. Hi. Yeah, by a boat. By a boat? All right, guys. Leslie, you guys, you guys remember Leslie because she scared the crap out of me. We hit her and Eric, they um, went like 90 miles an hour on one of these. Uh, this is a solstice, guys. This is a solstice. We did a video on the solstice and we also did a video on the open. And Eric took me going about maybe 90 miles an hour, 80 something miles an hour. I was like, hey, listen, bro. I want to go home to my family and uh but but yeah so 
Let's see, tell Eric I said hello. Okay. We're live on YouTube. All right, guys, Midnight Express in the house. All right, guys, so we're jumping in on. Oh, this is going to be interesting. We got Sea Hunter. Guys, what do you think right here? You think that could be you right now? Right now, ready? Put some, put some background noise. Wow, dude. Guys, you have no idea how fast it feels on the water. I'm telling you guys, it feels that fast. So sick. So sick. So sick. Oh, so sick. And then you just get snapped out of it and you just want to go fishing and just beat up waves. Look at this catamaran here for Sea Hunter. These guys, these are made in Princeton, Florida. Not far from me, actually. Badass boats. Look at this. Oh, guys. Get ready and wait for it. Oh, look at the concepts, bro. Look at the 44. This is a 44. Oh, they got two 44s. Oh, wait a second. Oh, boy. Get ready. Get ready. I, I have to. I have to. I have to force. Oh, yeah? Sorry, man. Damn. You always get me, but we're still going to do one. We're going to have to do. I'm, I'm live on YouTube. You can't be mean to me. You can't. Can you? Can she be mean to me right now? No. No, but you know, it's too early. But we're going to go. We're going to do a video. Look, they're asking. Hey, comment below if you want to see a video with me and her on this boat right here. Walk through. That's it. I just put you on the spot. I mean, you're on blast. That's it. It's over. The concept. Oh, my God. Look at this, guys. These are the 44s. 44 concept. What do you guys think? Huh? Smash a like for concept. These are badass. Yeah, I see the big sailboats, yeah. Oh my goodness. So, Eric looks like he's working a deal there. That's Eric. We'll walk with him. We're going to see if we do a, a dedicated walkthrough with him later. Oh, look at Mystic. All right. So, Guys, this is badass. Look at this. Badass. We're live on YouTube, guys. We we we're gonna we're gonna walk. I gotta walk both of these. We're gonna have to do this. They're they're gonna drool when they see this in 4K. Guys, you're gonna drool. It's the chicho. It's happening right now as we speak. You gotta take a picture with the chicho. That is so wide, God. All right. So listen up. So, ah, <laughs> we got it, we got it, <laughs> the chit show guys, it's wild, all right, so look, check this out, look at these, look at these engines, and the little lights here, guys, there's a surprise, big surprise here at the show, something that we haven't seen in a long time, and I told you guys this was going to be a badass video. So here is the exit, uh, one of the exits of the show, right? But right here, we have performance boat centers out of Fort Lauderdale. And uh, we got some uh, a sensation, but we also have a cigarette. And typically, I have never seen cigarette here at the show. And we have a cigarette being represented here, but it gets better, guys. It gets better. Hey, you get the best job here. Why you say that? Because you've got the best uh, playground in the United States this, of America this, and the world. This is a good job. In the world. This is a good job. You're not lying. <laughs> All right, guys. Look at the cigarette. Absolutely stunning. Right? But let's cross over. Oh, no. He's crossing over. I'm the Chicho. Yeah, there you go. The Chicho. <laughs> guys, look at this. Isn't that wild? What, what, what do you guys think about this? Huh? How sexy is this thing? All right, yeah, we're going to have to do a dedicated walkthrough. 4K. Yeah, absolutely. We're live on YouTube right now. I just saw you uh, doing a kit show with a guy backing off his uh, trailer. Oh, no, the 40 minute, uh -huh. the first day motor <laughs> in Boca. All right. All right, guys. So we got some MTI. 
with how much better the Mercury DJ, let's go. We're live. Go, 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 go. We're live on YouTube. Hey, what's up, guys? Say what hello. Say hello to a 50-foot monster. Yeah. Is uh, the terrorizer of Hallover in the building? Is Taylor around? Taylor's right over there with Tom. There she is. There she is. Hey, how's the show so far, Steven? Oh, it's been really good. We sold a bunch of boats already. And uh, we're just two days in, so we've got three, three more days to go. And we're seeing it to be a really good turnout. Tell Taylor I want to walk this one right here, this 50-foot uh, monster with uh, Quince. What do you think? You think she'll, happen? she'll make it happen? I think so. And that's the one that's coming right here. All right, guys. MTI in the house. Bro, don't 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 make don't make me bring Fred the crack. The myth, the legend. Hey, don't you? Uh, six five two twenty five ripped, right? Six five. Alfred, we love you, baby. Hey, doing it, baby. Go fast. Fred is right here. He's right here. He's here. Fred the crack. I love you, Alfred. Thank you, bro. I love you. All right, guys. Hey, we're live on YouTube. Check out the restream. What's up? All right, guys. Oh, it's wild, the chit show over here, guys. Well, if you guys don't know, the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show is now managed and run by Informa. <gasps> and you are seeing this right, guys. You are seeing this right. I am filming and we have the world famous Cigarette in Fort Lauderdale, guys. Fort Lauderdale Boat Show. This is the first time ever I see the cigarette brand here in Fort Lauderdale. So this is the 59 Tirana. John Ruiz is now managing and he's the owner of Cigarette. What's up, guys? We're live on YouTube. We are live on YouTube. What's good, boys? Welcome to Cigarette. I told you we were going to be live, and we're live. How are you guys? How's everything? Oh, I'm telling you, I'm so surprised that we are Cigarette in Flibs, guys. This is a first, a uh, first for Alfred Montaner. It's been a while since you guys have been here. Yes, sir. So, guys, we have some amazing boats here. I told you guys to, to wait for it. Look, look at this. Look at this monster. So, one of the things when I talk to John, uh, John Ruiz, I said, uh, so what, so what are some of the plans that he has? And he's like, hey, I want to bring back the nostalgia that um, Cigarette had, right? So there's, there's such an iconic brand and such a great community. And uh, he has a lot of great ideas and innovations. So stay tuned for that. I definitely want to welcome him in, into my channel because you guys have never really met him. So it's going to be interesting, guys. Oh. The, these boats are made in Miami, the Nova boats. They're made here in Miami. Jaguar, this is a cat. This thing flies. All right, guys, I think, wait, are, are we, are we gonna, oh, look at this. So we got black water. This, this black water looks hot. What do you guys think? Very nice boat. Oh yeah. This is a 43 sport fish, guys. This looks badass. You know what? I did a I did a video of the smaller back black waters in the convention center. You guys stick stick around. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't seen some of the stuff that I put on online. You're going to want to see it because it's a lot of cool stuff. So, oh, you guys got to see this fountain. You guys are going to want to see this fountain. Deep impacts here. Wow. Cool stuff, guys. Deep impact over here in Fort Lauderdale. Look at this. Look at this monster, guys. I, I haven't gotten a uh, walkthrough yet. I haven't tried, right? I haven't tried, but this is one of those boats that I definitely wanna, I definitely wanna walk. 
Look at this thing. Oh my goodness, guys. Hey, if you didn't make it to the Fort Lauderdale show, try to make it to the Miami show. You guys are going to see some incredible builds. And uh, this is the fountain. Badass. So nice. Look at that. Um, badass boats, guys. More fountains here. I don't know, smash the like guys, smash the like if you guys like the content that you're seeing. <gasps> Wait a second, I missed a rib boat, where's that rib boat? What is that, Chaser Yachts? Oh, I gotta come back for sure, I haven't seen that one. Don't be trying to hide from me. All right, let me go ahead and see if I can go to the stream, guys. Let me see, I'm gonna try to go to the live chat. I haven't, haven't been able to address anybody because I wanna make sure that we're getting good uh, footage, okay? All right, so wait for it, because we're gonna try to walk to HCB now. All right, let's see if we maybe have enough. Maybe we might have enough battery to get to HCB, guys. HCB, and there's a monster, monster Gulf Stream. I want you guys to see as well. 545 people. How many likes do we guys got here, guys? Out from Montana here, Chicho, Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show. And uh, guys, this is live right now. So, we got some sea rays here. All right, let's go okay. past the Intrepid booth. So here's what we did. We just did a loop, right? We just did an entire loop. You guys are seeing this as it happens. Um, if you guys want to see this in 4K, I'll probably restream this. And I'm also gonna do a dedicated video similar to this. Just, you're not running as fast as, and you know, focusing on a little bit more because I'm restricted with the, the amount of time I could be on, uh, on the stream, right? All right, so look, we're coming up to HCB. So, guys, I don't know where this goes. I'm live. This, this, can, this can be great or it can end with me in the water going bloop, 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 bloop. You zoomed in on me when I was fat. And I told you to get off my lawn and you never left. Wait for it. Yeah, welcome to HCB, 53 sueños, my friends. Um, what do you think? That on your dock or what? What do you think? I think so. Um, badass, badass monster. Who do we got in the hat? We have Cybermine, Dimelo, says Robert. And uh, this is a 53 sueños, guys. But wait for it, because the one I really, wow, look at this. Oh boy. If you guys just joined the stream, I started the video at the Solis booth and I was fortunate enough to do an interview with Stephen Doherty um, from Solis. So um, right now we have just got to Solis. I'm sorry, to, to HCB. So HCB Yachts. And uh, this is this is the one I wanted, guys. I have to, I have to find, I have to find Forrest. Forrest and I always do videos of the HCB boats. And I saw Forrest in uh, where did I see? Him? I saw him in Annapolis. So guys, badass. I love this color. And uh, I haven't seen Forrest yet, but. I'll tell you what, guys, this thing is... Oh, look at the back. I haven't seen this. Oh, this is different. I haven't seen this at all. Oh, we got quads, guys. Quad 600s on this bad boy. Can you say, wait for it? Look at that monster, guys. Wow. Is Forrest around? Yeah. He's there? He's inside. I, tell him Alfred passed by. I'm, I'm live on YouTube, so tell him Alfred was live looking for you. Tell him, tell him play around with him. Tell him Alfred says you owe him money. <laughs> Give Forrest a hard time. He's like, damn. I, had, I, I thought I bought the painkillers over there in Annapolis. Oh, guys, if you don't know about the painkillers, there's a place called Pusser's over there in Annapolis. And they have a frozen drink called the painkiller. Similar to kind of like if you come to Miami, we have a place called Wet Willies. And uh, 
they have one called a 90, one, uh, 190 octane. For a 90 octane, or I don't know, it's one of those things that you wake up on the beach, you're at a bathtub with ice, you don't, you're missing your kidneys, and you're like, wow, it was a good night, but damn, I really want my kidneys back. Bonadeo. This is pretty nice. Hold on, wait for it. Wait for it. Wow. You guys love this boat every time I film it. It's gonna happen. I already talked to Hunter. He said, come back before the show's over. I'm gonna show you this all new Gulfstream yachts, guys. What do you think? What do you think about this? This is on another level. Oh, and uh, it's got a quad 600s. So, some of you guys have seen the Pardos that come in and out of Hallover and the New River when we film on the New River. Should have wore your new boots, We did some walkthroughs of the of these as well. Guys, do me a favor and smash that like. Look, look at this. I mean, this this could be a thumbnail. This could be a thumbnail in any uh, any boat show, like 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 right here, right here, right there, right there. Look at that. Look at that. I mean, tell me, is that not the sexiest thing you've ever seen in your life? Oh man, so cool. Very nice boats, guys. Oh wait, 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 wait. We got a forty-eight foot Anvera from Italy, guys. Inflatable. Wow. Look at this Anvera. Guys, oh my goodness. Oh. 48 foot rigid inflatable. This is their smaller version. They have a 50 something footer. Actually, I did a video on my channel. Type in Alfred Anvera and you'll see a video I did on the big boy. Guys, check this out. Air. Now all the way up to here, it comes and now it's carbon fiber. And these wings open up kind of like it is over there and you have a dance floor for like 50 people. Hey, what about this? You guys uh, want a little bit uh, of this monster? Uh oh. Oh man, guys, I think, I think we're getting, I think we're getting to the end of the road. Why? You guys want to go past? You guys, uh, hold on. Here's the thing. I'll walk, guys. I'm willing to walk because we're live, right? We, we still have a little bit of battery. But if you want, we can go to No Dock. I, uh, it's not really No Dock. I don't know what it's called, right? But I call it No Dock because I say, hey, can I do a video? They're like, no. And then I go to the next one. I go, hey, can I do a video? And they go, no. So you guys, hey, comment below if you guys want me to go to No Dock. But they're multi, multi-million dollar mega yachts. So we can end the stream here. I need you guys to say go if you want me to go. Let me see. Let me see the live chat, guys. Hold on. If you guys say go, we go. If we say no, we know. All right. All right, guys. Let's see. It's all. This is guys. This is all you. All right. We could. Uh, we could end here on this North Haven, which is very nice too. So let's see what we got. Damn, you guys want to go to Gold No Dock? All right, No Dock it is, guys. You guys won. Damn. I'll tell you what, I wouldn't mind doing an interview and a walkthrough on this guy. How badass is this? Nice. All right, guys. You guys say go. We go to No Dock. I, I, guys, I don't know. It's multi-million dollar mega yachts. This is what this show is really known for. But uh, like I said, they're like, hey, how you doing? My name is Alfred Monten. Like, no! I was like, I didn't even say who I am. No! <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. Listen, there, you know what it is. There's procedures, right? You got to check in, and and I, I, you know, I just go in there. Thank you so much. Yeah. Chicho in the house. How is it? What do you like the most about it? Everything. All right. We got to turn around. He's like, I know you're filming my lady. Ah, he's in the water. Chris Cross in the house. All right, guys. I got some interesting stuff I'm gonna show you too over here in No Dock. I hope this doesn't become a thing, right? They're gonna be like, oh, you're in No Dock. No! Get off my lawn! No, 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 no! 
All right, guys, get ready. But before we go to no dock, we haven't gotten there yet, guys. We're in one of the veins that gets, gets us there. We have a badass yellowfin here. And we also have the big boy yellowfin on the other side that uh, we have filmed and we can possibly do another walkthrough on these bad boys in a little bit too. It's been a great show, guys. Comment below if you guys have really enjoyed so far the walkthrough and all the things that we've done over here so far at the show. Guys, this is, this is not even the weekend, right? Imagine how it's gonna be tomorrow and Saturday and Sunday. All right, welcome to No Dock. Dude, this is huge. Look at the size of this mega yacht, guys. All right, well, you guys kind of see it, right? You, you, you guys can understand it now, right? So here is that yellowfin with quad 600s. This is a 50 something footer monster. And if you look right here, back look at the backdrop over there but talk about sweet boat huh it's a 54 that's right it's 54 with quad 600s bro how wild is that wait for it my friends all right so it's a big show guys good to see that i'm glad that you guys are enjoying the stream guys my name is alfred montaner i'm the host of the chit show if you just joined the stream we're live at the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show. I want to thank you guys for joining me here at uh, No Dock. Um, I don't even know what this dock is called, guys. I, I'm playing around. I call it No Dock, and, but it's, it's where the mega yachts are. And one day, one day, we are going we to make it, and we're going to turn No Dock into Go Dock, all right? And we're going to get on all these at one point, but we just got to keep on working, guys. Keep on liking these videos. Subscribe to the channel, share to your friends, and one day we'll make it. We'll make it to the top of this um, ship right here. What do you guys think? Look at this thing. I'll just, I'll just want, I just want the rib. You can keep the yacht. I just want the rib. Look, and it's got 300s. I know how to fix those. You guys, I want to go on there and uh, on film the boat. Can I do that? Uh, do you have a business card? Um, I'll get it in a little bit. Okay. Uh, thank you so thank much. You. Translation. No doc. No, no, no. I told you guys. I told you. Tell them what? CIA. Hey, take a break. Don't work so hard. Hey, I'm live on YouTube, man. Always live. Always live. Always live. Tell them you're with my company. All right, guys. Hey, listen. I'm with Max over here. There you go. Hey, Max. We're live on YouTube. Okay. If I, I'm, I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna put this in front. I'm gonna go. Hey. Go. I'm here with Max. There and if, go. if they say, who's that? They say, hey, tell them to call me. All right. All right, guys. Max owns uh, the ship, guys. Good luck, good luck. There you go. All right, listen up. Continue over here. So, Chicho, Chicho, with the C. Chicho, Chicho. All right, all right, guys. Look at this one. Look at this one. This is another one. This is another monster that. Yeah. So, you know, everything is perspective, right? Like uh, Jeff Bezos will look at this and uh, be like, you won't find me, you won't find me caught on none of these little, little baby ships or baby yachts. So it's all perspective, guys. So, oh, oh boy, wait for it. You guys remember the Vanquish that we've been seeing on the New River? We are live on YouTube. We are live on YouTube showing off the Vanquish. Hello, Vanya. Hello, Tom. Nice to meet you guys. Great. Thank you very much. Guys, you guys love this boat. And we have seen the Vanquish in and out of the show. And uh, this is the 58 Vanquish. We did a walkthrough with Vanya and Tom. We're live on YouTube. We're going to see it. We did an interview with Vanya. She did great. You did great. Vanya did great, guys. All right. So listen up. If you're here at the show, all right, let me give you guys some perspective. Now, the Vanquish, uh, we were able to do a, a video on them 
and we have done multiple videos and we've shot this boat coming in out of haul over we've caught it out of the new river as well so this right here is the new river guys so so when you see me filming all right so this is where the water taxi comes in and in a little while if i were to sit here long enough we would catch the carry b uh the cardi b i'm sorry some of the boats that we recognize when we're filming the new river series okay so the new river is back here connected here so we would go actually over there to the right and uh and this is the uh taxi a uh, water taxi drop off so you would come in here you get off on the water taxi you join the show and you're like wow this is amazing and then your first introduction to these mega yachts the vanquish and uh oh wait there's another one did i miss it guys there's something i want you guys to see damn i, I think i dropped max card max oh man mangusta okay wait there is there is a tender in this area that i want you guys to see did i miss it i think i did guys hold on let me see if i see it um yes we did miss it oh it's a little further down all right well i'll tell you what guys there's a little tender i want you guys to see but let's go let's keep on walking so if we wanted to go back to the dock where where we just walked we would go through here but now we're going to continue here and this is also this is not like the mega yachts these are kind of like you know ferretti group you got a lot of nice boats here i think um riva all those brands are coming in and out of here as well let me show you guys where you would come over here and eat if you wanted to go ahead and have lunch while we're here there's a nice wally that i want you guys to see too i did a video of the wally a couple shows ago but i want you guys to see this one as well all right guys comment below how many people we have in the stream let me see how many people are in the stream All right, here's the, uh, where are those champagnes being sold? Where, where are they selling those? Oh, she was like, damn. I'm not here with my husband. Oh no, I don't know what happened. All right, guys, this is, this is the Wally. What do you guys think? Um, wait for it or what? 600 people watching the stream, guys. I'm surprised that we have the coverage that we do we, we have super nice i think that's a dope ass boat huh yeah ferretti nope. in the house well, it looks like they, uh, all right off the all right the smart um all right guys so going back this way is the same docks that we have also right we where we started the kind of the video at solis we have don't worry about guys somebody coughed but they're they're a downwind from us we're good we're we're good all right so if you were going to come over here and you wanted to go ahead and level out sit down get in a little shaded area this would kind of be like the food area so if there's anybody famous that's chowing down on a I don't know some type of steak sandwich you know why right because they're hungry so this is where you would chill it's kind of cool here the temperature is a little bit better because it's a lot more shaded but I want to show you guys some of the food options that you guys have while you're here at the show oh no all right so listen up it says that we ran out of SD card but we're still streaming guys so we're still streaming I think we're still streaming yeah, we still have battery. So when you come here and you're hungry, this is the whole food area. You come hang out there and then you have food here. All these little uh, kind of like kiosk and tents that you have a lot of options. ATMs over there. Um, I'll tell you what, there are a lot of these places are only allowing payments in credit cards. So keep that in mind. 
and uh, you also have some bathrooms up here coming up. But here's here's what I want to show you guys. This is happening as we speak. Look at this. Beautiful. Look at that. Wow, that is so delicious. I love it. All right, so what do you guys think? Wait for it or what? I think it's worth it. All right. So consider yourself lucky, guys, if you watch the live stream because the 4K version of this, the SD card ran out. A uh, little tip, guys, if you're in the area and you want to go to the restroom, there's a restroom back here, indoors, air conditioned, so you can catch it there. Now we're going to come around. We're now essentially going back. We just crossed over back Love to the... What's going on, man? Everything good? We're live on YouTube. Oh, look at that. Spill on the water. Spill on the water. We're live. What are you doing, dude? I got an appointment. I got to go. Right here. I hope. I hope. Boat show. All right, Bill on the water, guys. I didn't. I didn't even recognize him with a hat. That's Bill on the water. Check out his channel. Wait, 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 wait. Bill on the water. So he has a YouTube channel, guys. Go check him out. Look, we got some sea legs here. I'm talking about the boat, guys, not the girls in the swing. Look at that, cool stuff. What do you guys think? Look at that. Super, super cool stuff. How cool is this video, man? We started this video at Solis and uh, we're right now essentially heading back. I'll tell you what, I, I might have a surprise for you. I might bombard somebody else. Let's see. Hold on, let's see how far. There's 560 people still in here. Is that right? All right, so here you have uh, Yamaha outdoor booth. Nice and open, so if you are a little uncomfortable, you have a nice outdoor booth. Oh, oh, we almost got smacked. You guys remember Bill, uh, Ben from Big Bo Ben on YouTube? Um, where is he? Where is he? He's there somewhere. Look for the tallest guy there. Um, ben, let me tell you something. Ben and I have had some, I um, mean, we had a couple of nights after the shows that we're like, where did we end up, dude? So, all right, so if you just joined the stream, guys, we started in this area. We went essentially around the whole show almost, but I want to end this video with a nice little surprise. Maybe we have enough battery to make it. I think so. So let's see if we can make it. So we were on this dock. Oh, look, we, we, we have the, the Veecham, which was at the Annapolis show. We did a video on them too. Now in the direction that I'm walking to guys is the beach. So if you've seen Fort Lauderdale Beach, I've done some walking tours of the beach over here as well. It's pretty cool stuff. So I told you guys I have a surprise for you. Let's see. Let's see if I'm still live. I don't even know. I have to check. Guys, I'll read the entire comment either. section later. Yes, we are. We're still live, guys. We're still live. All right. All right. So a lot of you guys are big fans of uh, Pacific Northwest boating and, you know, trawlers. And one of the boats that I really want to show you guys, which you guys have, a lot of you have seen, a lot of you didn't see it. I didn't see the video. Yes, my friends, this is the coastal craft that we just sea trialed the other day. And Jeff, we're live on YouTube. 
And this is the last spot I wanted to end on. Can, can we show the bottom of the boat that we didn't show? They're telling me I want to buy it, but I never saw the lower deck. Hey, guys. Well, not the lower deck, the bottom, right? That, remember, we had stuff down there. Oh, sure. The basement. The basement. Well, I don't know what you call it. So, <laughs> so guys, we're live on YouTube, and we just got on board. What did we get on board? Tell them. 42-foot express fish. 42-express fish. Oh, and look, we have a visitor today. This, Does he come with the boat? This is Jersey. Jersey? No, she probably wouldn't want she, to go. She wouldn't want to go? Wow, how cool. So listen, I've been live, I've done almost the whole show, and I was like, how cool would it be if I just end the video at the Coastal Craft, which we just filmed the sea trial on, and a lot of people are gonna be watching this video like, yo, I missed that video. So, you wanna show it real quick? Sure. Let's go. All right, guys, here's Jeff, and he's gonna show us the Coastal Craft we just did a sea trial on. That's right. Let's go, come on, guys. Let's go ahead and, and walk in. So right immediately as you come to the door, on your port side, left hand side, we have the aft, right behind jersey, we have the aft berth, aft stayroom I should say, two single berths with a filler cushion to make that into a queen. That's what we couldn't show last time right. because we had a lot of storage because you guys had just gotten to the show. And then we have the privacy hatch, kind of ready to close it off. We have our settee to port, the co-pilot co seat. Port front seat, double wide, mm -hmm. and then the traditional helm, starboard side, and then the full galley. So we have all of our our main socializing area on one level, same as the deck. I love this, and let me tell you guys, if you want to see how this thing performs out in open ocean, we took it out, and it was it was like it was raining before we had gone out, and it rained again. But it doesn't matter when you're when you're on one of these boats. Right. Yeah, you're all closed in. You're good. We got AC. We got obviously this. Uh, if you guys want to see the full video, I'm going to link it to this video. Let's show them the birth area. Uh, oh, yeah. Jeff. All right, guys. So we got we got a head here, separate shower, and go. We have the main state room up front, queen size, island queen berth, outboard lockers, port, start room port lockers, lots of storage, drawers beneath the bed. All aluminum, guys. This is an all aluminum boat. A lot of people don't realize that. They think, oh, wow, outside it didn't look like it's an aluminum boat. But let's show them the, the, so the shower. port side, we have a shower with a six foot five headroom. And we proved that with uh, Dolph that. Uh, we did. And Dolph was making fun of short people. I mean, he's no longer with us anymore, guys. How many short people got him? <laughs> he, he, was, he was a nice guy, but you know. <laughs> It was a long story, guys. You got to watch that video to get the... <laughs> On the starboard side, we've got the, uh, the head. Beautiful. I'm looking at myself in the mirror, guys. I'm looking at myself in the mirror. Stop making a scene, guy. And one of the nice features of this boat is just how open. So much window. The big curved windshield up front. Pretty glass with the open panels. Starboard port. Uh, the massive sunroof. And then, of course, the glass. I love it. So much light in here. Yeah. You can close it up if you want. Um, I'm going to refer them there. Guys, I want to thank everybody that has contributed to the, today's video. I'm ending here at Coastal Craft, and uh, I want to thank you guys for watching the stream. My name is Alfred Monter. You know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and let you guys see what a sweaty Cuban looks like. Ready? Wait for it. Ah! Hey, Alfred Monter, ready? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to... Uh!